Mr. Myra, let me ask you first, uh, what do you make of, of this entire controversy over this renovation at the Planning Commission? Do you think it was unnecessary expenditure or are we going a little too far in this austerity debate? Uh, how do you look at it? Well, I think you raised uh, the bigger question about uh, the relevance of the Planning Commission and that seems to be an interesting question to ask because uh, the perception of uh, uh, the Planning Commission, what it cares about, what it represents, its utility is very much uh, in the air. So perhaps uh, you might get straight to that question uh, rather than uh, you know, the toilets. But if you want a view on the toilets, I could say that uh, having joined the Planning Commission just three years ago, um, I did feel that uh, uh, the, the toilets that uh, our staff were using, and I use the same toilets, were really in bad shape, badly maintained. And so I did myself, though it's not my business perhaps, start to suggest that uh, uh, the people who maintain the toilets should make sure that they're properly maintained, and which they found out that the pipes were clogged, they were very old, uh, and things were leaking, and was creating a stink all right. So I'm sure that uh, what they've gone and done is to, since they've got to update the toilets after so many years, to be sure that this time they've got something which is modern and will last a long time. I don't know about the cost uh, that is being uh, stated here. I haven't myself used those two toilet blocks that uh, uh, um, are in the, in the news now. But yes, the toilets in the Planning Commission, like most toilets in this country, I think, need much better maintenance and need to be updated from time to time because they get overused and uh, they wear out. I would, I, would, I would not disagree with you on that. But let me link this now to the larger question because this is not a debate uh, about, about the lose in the Planning Commission. Let me ask you, Mr. Myra, that, uh, you know, is the Planning Commission dealing with a serious perception problem right now? You know, when today's headlines are dominated by uh, what many perceive to be lavish expenditure or, on, on toilets in the building. Uh, you know, is there a perception problem that the Planning Commission is dealing with that it's, it's not really doing what it was meant to do? Absolutely. I mean, what's the point of uh, discussing that? Uh, that it, is, it is having a perception problem. And is the Planning Commission doing what it was meant to do? Uh, that's one question. And is the Planning Commission doing what it should now do? which is uh, probably a, 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 an even more important question to ask. Now, when I joined the Planning Commission uh, three years ago, um, I was asked by the Prime Minister and the present Deputy Chairman, that's Dr. Aluwalia, to, uh, because of my background in management, to uh, uh, help suggest how the Planning Commission could update itself, could renovate itself. So I requested them to give me the names of 20 persons in the country from various sectors that the country would respect and that they would respect the opinions of. So I was given the names of some very eminent industrialists, I was given the names of some very eminent economists, some heads of institutions, some currently in institutions, some retired, and some political leaders. And uh, I must tell you, when I wrote to each of them and said, look, we've got a question before us, should there be a planning commission, would you like to please give me your views? They all, with great speed, said, please come, I'd like to talk to you. So I met these 20 persons and I asked them this first question, should we have a planning commission today? Uh, that really was a more difficult question for them to answer, so I put it another way. Should the planning commission as it is continue? And they said, oh, that's a simple answer. No, it should not. I said, then, okay, let's say it's closed. Should we consider having some institution in this country that fulfills a need that the country has today. And then they discussed what is the need of the country today in the present configuration, India in a global economy, India in a, in a situation where we don't have a single party ruling across the country, many parties contending, coalition governments, a much larger private sector than we had when the Planning Commission was set up. Do you have the Indie TV Profit app? All the markets, all the news and your own homemade, ready-made portfolio available there for you. We will right now answer what you should sell, what you should buy when markets are down. Download at IndieTVProfit.com slash apps. Get the best app from the channel you trust.